government injects a lot of money, we need impact of those monies. The purpose of her being here, as highlighted by my peers, is to bring our minds together on generating solutions that speak to the aspirations of HE, the president, as stipulated in the NRM manifesto. For instance, how can commercialization of agriculture lead to socio-economic transformation? It is important to note that this agriculture, where our country has a comparative advantage in whatever we are doing in this country. That's why we have a comparative advantage. Therefore, all efforts must be put in place to make sure that agriculture is the fulcrum for our socio-economic transformation. We have, we have invested quite a lot of money in the, in the, in the, in the range of trillions, 7, .7 trillion, for instance, in trying to promote agriculture over the period of 10 years. So uh, I think we would have done. There is some substantial, uh, substantial uh, results we are seeing, but uh, I think we would do better. Yeah.